forecast. It's 11.06 now, and it's another chilly fall day here yeah. in Western New York. Here's a live look outside. Kevin, it yeah. looks like it's only 50 degrees. It's hard to see from over here, but it was kind of cool out this morning and drizzly. So will with will this gray and wet weather be continuing? We have more drizzle, uh, faux shizzle, uh, and again, some scattered showers across western New York. Uh, Lake Enhanced, the northern flow, bringing the comparatively cold air over the still 64 degree uh, Lake Ontario. And uh, yeah, it's the same mechanism that does lake effect snow, but it's certainly too warm, thankfully, at 50 degrees. Uh, so lake showers are at 51 degrees. All right, now with that update, and you see the area of low pressure, see the spin. Uh, now that area of low pressure continuing to move eastward and sort of losing its uh, um, connection to us and uh, eventually losing its impact on us. But the clouds will hang around today and tomorrow. In addition to the lake effect, light showers and areas of drizzle. Uh, Wednesday and Thursday, best days of the week for outdoor family fun or whatever, getting around and golfing or mowing the lawn. Uh, family portraits, whatever in the fall, uh, because next weekend things look like they're going to take a downturn once again. Uh, so again, uh, flow from the north bringing in this uh, cloud cover. You see the lake effect rain across uh, all the Great Lakes. And you can see uh, right now, let's see Ithaca, Cortland getting some rain off of Ontario. And uh, we certainly will. Well, we have gotten some drizzle and light rain and we'll continue to do so today. So 53, the clouds hang around. We'll take you day by day and zone by zone when I'm back downstairs. Kelly? Kevin, thank you.